welcome. Look, I burn myself. Um, welcome to Lisa Marvin Art. Okay, today I don't exactly know what I'm doing, but I know that it's Christmas time. And I'm Jewish, which doesn't matter. Uh, but I don't often do Christmas pours. I actually don't do Hanukkah pours either. But I, ha I was um, inspired by TLP Rad, which I have not used yet. It's the new Red Neon. It is like the color of my nail polish. I haven't used it, but I really like looking at it. So I figured why not use it for the perfect Christmas combo. Now, um, I'm not really into red and greens. So my original idea was red and turquoise, like my flavor of Christmas, you know? Um, I really do think these will look nice together. You're gonna ask me what color this is. Um, I'm gonna say it is like a teal, like golden teal, you know? It's most likely what it is. So why not? Golden teal and rad. And then I said to myself, shit, my thing happened down here. Just a minor spell. What I said to myself was, why not break out my spray paints again? Because that was really fun. So why not spray some gold and do like, I'm envisioning like little, I guess not mistletoe. Why not little mistletoe? Uh, or mistletoe-ish, right? So I have like little things. And then obviously I need a sparkle. So I have TLP um, ball gown, which you can't see, gold interference. So I'm kind of envisioning that over the red, okay? And then I do need like another color. So I said, fine, I'll go green with my shadow green because that's a green that doesn't offend my senses. Although a lot of greens don't offend my senses, but I don't know, you know how I am about greens. So that's the color. So we're going, now again, I have no plan, right? I'm just like kind of seeing gold spray paint and a little, and like I'll do, the greens first, like kind of like a bloom vine. I don't know what I'm doing, whatever. Let's just do it. Okay. So I have my pillow here. It might be a little thick today. Everything's stuck because I painted yesterday and then it dried together, but I have my 12 inch round here. Okay. Now I'm going to layer things in the middle because then I'm gonna spin it out and then do something, okay? So, I know, it's, we'll see. I mean, that should be enough. Okay, so here we go. This is a PBO spray. I don't even remember if it's a good gold or not, but. Okay, I'm gonna spray it. Sorry, and so, I've done it two ways where I've sprayed it, I don't think with this brand, with another brand, and it kind of like leaves a cool film on top and then it kind of breaks up and look crackled. Or if you spray from far away, you'll just get specks. So let's see. Ooh, I love that. Okay. So this is gonna like kind of crackle and break apart. I can't get enough. Okay. Ooh, I like these like drips that I did by accident, but okay. Yes, you should wear a mask, etc. I'm going to go overboard with the gold, because why not? Okay, so now I have a choice. Okay. Um, I could make the green leaves and then spin it out and do like the little, little mistletoe. I don't know if we're going mistletoe anymore, but... Um, Seems like a cool kind of cracking. All right, why don't I I'm go like this? We still don't know what I'm doing, but I really had fun spray painting, to be honest. Going like this. There should be enough to spend. Okay, let's just go for it, right? Okay. So we have a cool crackling effect. 
And I'm gonna go now with my greens and make some sort of, uh, I don't know, something. Trust me. Cause I do want it minimal and I do want the gold to show through. It's a little buble, boop. Okay, ooh, I love, I don't know if you can see because the gold, the paint is pushing the gold back out. It's making like a gold outline. I don't think that's gonna stay, but it's really cool. Um, I enjoy that. Mm, 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 mm. I will, you know what? I'm gonna put the uh, a bit of ball gown in the middle and I'm gonna put that teal on top. And I wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna blow on this, but maybe I will and get some like cool things happening. Okay. Just a little bit. Okay. Again, we don't know what's happening, but, or should I do, mm, maybe I'll do Payne's Gray, like a dark cell activator, okay? Schmooge it and then do a white cell activator over the rad, if I'm gonna do that. Again, we still don't know, but this is Payne's Gray. A little thick, but we'll deal with it. I like these colors already. I just have to execute it properly, right? Um, okay, hmm, and I wanna blow gentle. I'm just gonna start here, and I don't need that many cells for my liking. Kind of cool. See, I love the areas with no cell activator. Um, kind of fun, right? Something's fun so far. Um, I'll blow it out from here. Okay. Okay. Cool. Like, I wish actually this could stay this way. <laughs> it's kind of cool. Okay. I don't mind what's happening here. I'm just gonna spin it. I was gonna do something to it, but I'm actually really um, enjoying the shape. It is looking very like uh, oceany, like a, you know, those, like coral-ish, which is cool. So maybe we're just going, we'll see if I change my mind about Christmas and I'm just making coral. Now I'm not, what am I doing with the red? I actually kind of just like what's happening here. Like why am I, you know what I mean? Hmm. Is that weird? Like, what would I even do right now? Oh, guys. You know, you're looking at it, you're like, what is going on? But there's something about it that I'm actually really enjoying. Maybe I would just do touches of red. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'm gonna like kind of ruin it maybe, but like, what if I just do a bit of red here? Okay, and like here, and we're just making coral. You know what I mean? Now we're, we're coral. We've passed Christmas, we're now into summertime. All right, and then, I really like this look, but wouldn't it be pretty with a pop of color? So what if I just do like a dot here, okay? and then blow a little, little bit out and like a dot here just to do something interesting. I don't know, hold on. So I have my white cell activator now. We're just having fun, right? I'm gonna do a dot, okay?
okay dot of red i don't know so there's no point of really doing them separate at this point but we didn't know that at the time you know oops sometimes you've got to you know I'm just trying to get like layers of coral, okay? And I'll like schmooze them about as I need. So like we'll put another piece of coral here, right? Golden coral. I guess we'll do Christmas another day. <laughs> I don't even know what my original idea was, so. Sometimes it's just fun to play without expectation because that's when you get like some really fun ideas. I don't know, like this is, am I right? Like this is kind of cool, right? Am I nuts? You guys maybe be like, what is she talking about? Okay, and I think like a cool red coming up here a little bit, okay. see why don't I call it Christmas coral like a Christmas carol <laughs> don't laugh while you blow okay I don't like having so much fun am I am I a nut like do you see Am I, am I nuts? I, maybe just because it's like different. I'll put a little more right here or something. You know what I mean? Maybe just because it's like, you know, a very um, purposeful thing where we're layering, which I love, you know? Okay, like this is a little dark. So now I'm wondering if I should take my skewer and start incorporating them a little bit. Like here, you know, but I don't want too much of the white. Okay. Now I don't want to do this actually right now because I still have to spin and you know I don't like when it get, gets wonky. Mm. I'd like to bring a bit of red so I'm just going to actually take my stick and no don't do that and just paint with it. Bring some red up here to start drawing the red in a little bit more to make it uh, kind of incorporate more within the shapes. That's cool. I wonder if I should have spun it out a bit more. We'll see. I'm liking where this is going. Do you see like these like whimsical lines? Okay. Whimsical. Quite whimsy. Cool. Okay. Right. Uh, that's too much. Yeah. Cute. I'm having fun. <laughs> okay, whimsical. Whimsical. Here we go. I'm liking what's happening. I'm gonna do one up here. This way. I really like drawing with the paint. Um, okay, I don't wanna go overboard though, but I'm really liking these red lines. Okay, I'm gonna start spinning. I'm gonna hope for the best. 
you know. Kind of cool. I really like what's happening. Hold on, there's a boob line you will get. Right? Like, it's kind of neat. I think it's cool. Let's see how much more we got to spend in a little bit, eh? So next time, I might spin it like, there's a black thing, one more time before I start layering um, the paints. I think this is really cool though, and I really want to do another one actually with different colors even, you know? There's just a lot of interest, and I really am loving my lines and the different layers of stuff. I think it's really cool. Um, how are we doing here? Hold on. Yep. I wish I didn't have to spin it anymore. But it just looks like so cool. I can't get over it. I hope you guys agree. Normally when I really like stuff, it is, they're not that popular. But I think I just like that it's different. And that you do have to put a little bit of effort into it. Um, and you get to like build and paint you know, rather than hope for the best, which we always do. The sparkles are really awesome. Okay, let me do a close-up for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this uh, Christmas coral. <laughs> um, tell me what you think of like the, the layering, the painting, the line work, which I'm really digging. I'm definitely gonna play with it again. Um, okay, love you guys. Merry Christmas, bye.